So I never get asked how to shorten a luteal phase because usually it's people asking how to lengthen their luteal phase because having a short luteal phase can lead to spotting before your period. It can also be a risk factor for miscarriage if you wanna get pregnant because if your luteal phase is really short, therefore you're making less progesterone and we need progesterone in order to balance estrogen. So again, you might see that spotting, you might also get really bad PMS. Luteal phase is the second part of your cycle. So you have your follicular phase, we ovulate, and then now we're in our luteal phase after we ovulate. And the luteal phase is pretty stuck in its way. So if you have a 12 day luteal phase, it's really always gonna be 12 days. If your cycle is lengthening, that would be because the follicular phase is lengthening. So basically there was some sort of delay in ovulation. Your luteal phase can't really keep going because it's dependent on the health of the corpus luteum. So basically your corpus luteum will make progesterone, it'll keep that phase alive, and then eventually it will start to degrade and make less progesterone where your hormones will fall and you'll get your period. So if your luteal phase is continuing, that means you're pregnant. Otherwise that corpus luteum will regress and you will get your period. Maybe you're asking how to shorten the luteal phase because you have a really bad, angry PMSC luteal phase, which is super common because our hormones are chaotic. A lot of times this is due to having high estrogen or low progesterone. And we can do a lot with our lifestyle, our diet, and then even supplementing to help control that. If you're wondering how you figure out how long your luteal phase is, you have to figure out when you ovulate and you can do that by charting like your cervical mucus and your temperature. And once you figure out when you ovulate, you just count the number of days until you get your period. And that will give your luteal phase length. If you have any specific questions about the luteal phase, drop them down below and I'll get to them.